Epic Battle, Sheriff Rathwood versus Elsa Aurora. Setting, Andy's Bedroom. The moonlight filtered through the curtains of Andy's bedroom, casting an eerie glow over the familiar terrain. The room, once a place of joyful imagination, now stood as the battleground for an Sheriff Rathwood, a dark and twisted version of Woody, and Elsa Aurora, the icy embodiment of Elsa from Frozen. Sheriff Rathwood stood tall and menacing, his glowing red eyes piercing the darkness. His black cowboy hat cast a shadow over his face, and the crimson bandana around his neck fluttered ominously. Across from him, Elsa Aurora stood poised and regal, her platinum blonde hair shimmering in the moonlight, her ice blue gown radiating an ethereal glow. This is where it ends, Elsa, Sheriff Rathwood drawled, his voice a low, menacing rumble. Welcome to the playroom, partner. Elsa's eyes narrowed, her breath visible in the cold air surrounding her. I will not allow your twisted vision to prevail, she replied, her voice calm but firm. Prepare yourself. Without another word, the battle began. Round one, clash of powers. Sheriff Rathwood drew his revolver, firing energy bolts that crackled with dark energy. Elsa countered by raising a shimmering ice shield, deflecting the bolts effortlessly. With a graceful sweep of her arm, she summoned a blizzard that engulfed the room, turning it into a frozen wonderland. Ice spread rapidly, coating the floor and walls, making the environment hostile to all but her. Rathwood was undeterred. With a flick of his wrist, he unleashed his dark energy lasso. It crackled through the air, aiming to ensnare Elsa. But she was quick, creating an ice barrier that shattered upon contact with the lasso, sending shards flying. Rathwood dodged them with agility, his spurred boots jingling eerily. Round two, strategy and manipulation. Elsa, seeing the room transforming into her domain, used her cryokinesis to animate toy soldiers and dinosaurs, turning them into icy minions that charged at Rathwood. He responded by animating toys of his own, transforming them into dark puppets under his control. The two armies clashed, a chaotic mix of ice and darkness. Rathwood, ever the strategist, manipulated the battlefield. He used his reality warping powers to create pockets of darkness where his toy minions could hide and ambush Elsa's icy creations. He knew he needed to close the distance. You can't win, Elsa, Rathwood taunted. This room, this world, it bends to my will. Elsa responded with a wave of her hand, creating a massive ice golem that roared and charged at Rathwood. He stood his ground, channeling dark energy into his lasso. As the golem reached him, he swung the lasso, wrapping it around the creature and pulling tight. The golem shattered into a thousand pieces, its essence dissipating. Round three, the final showdown. The room was a battlefield of shattered ice and broken toys. Both combatants were showing signs of wear, but neither was willing to back down. Elsa, her resolve icy and unyielding, raised her hands, creating a massive ice storm. The temperature plummeted, frost spreading rapidly. Rathwood, feeling the cold seeping into his bones, knew he had to end it quickly. Summoning the last of his strength, he charged through the storm, his red eyes glowing brighter. Elsa met his charge, creating ice weapons and launching them at him. He dodged and deflected with his revolver, closing the gap between them. With a final, final desperate move, Elsa attempted to freeze Rathwood solid. Her hands glowed with icy power as she unleashed a torrent of freezing energy. Rathwood, caught in the blast, gritted his teeth against the cold, but he pressed forward, inch by inch, his dark determination unwavering. As he reached Elsa, he swung his lasso one final time. The dark energy crackled and wrapped around her, binding her tightly. Elsa struggled, but the lasso's power was too great. Rathwood's eyes gleamed with triumph. Welcome to the playroom, partner he whispered, tightening the lasso. The dark energy surged through Elsa, transforming her slowly. Her ice, her ice powers faltered and faded, her form shrinking and hardening. In moments, Elsa Aurora was no more. In her place stood a small, beautifully crafted doll, her ice blue dress now just fabric, her frozen heart now a simple, inanimate core. Sheriff Rathwood stood over the doll, breathing heavily. He picked her up, his sister grin widening. The world will know the power of forgotten toys, he vowed, his red eyes gleaming in the moonlight. The battle was over, and Sheriff Rathwood had emerged victorious. Andy's bedroom, now a testament to the epic clash, fell silent once more, the moonlight casting long shadows over the remnants of the fierce struggle.